Hello, welcome to Unicorn Princess Tarot. So ito po ang ating reading, Twin Flame reading para sa mga Aries. Uh, this is for February to March 2021. Paalala lang, hindi ito para sa lahat. Taso kunin mo lang yung mga messages na tumutugma sa'yo. And also guys, this is a Twin Flame reading. So, um, very rare ito ha. Hindi talaga to para sa lahat. Kung gusto mong malaman kung ano ang Twin Flame, i-check mo lang ang description box. Kasi nandyan yung ating link para sa video na nag explain kung ano ang Twin Flame at mga senyales nito. Para malaman mo if you're dealing with your Twin Flame, feel free to check it out. Okay, dyan sa description box natin. Ayan. So, kung hindi ka pa nakaka-like, please do like and subscribe to our channel. Nagpapakita po yan ng support sa akin. And maraming salamat po sa mga comments nyo. Na-appreciate ko lahat ng yan. Start na natin ang reading. By the way, meron din po tayong other channel sa Madam PTV. May mga Aries reading din po tayo dyan. Feel free to check it out. So, yeah. We have your retreat and release your ex. By the way, yung left side, yung sa person mo, yung right, yung sa'yo. Pero pwede magkapalit-palit ang roles. Depende sa nangyayari sa'yo. Pwede ikaw yung sa left, yung person mo, yung sa right. Pero kukunin natin tong left sa person mo. We have your retreat and release your ex. Um, for what I can see here, there's disconnection. Disconnection. Yung person mo is like releasing you. Maaaring ipinauubaya niya na. Okay? Sobrang nasasaktan siya ngayon. Sobrang nahihirapan siya. At saka, there's a lot of pain here. I'm sorry. Medyo naiiyak ako pagka nakukuha ko yung energy ng sobrang sakit. And you might be crying right now. Kasi nararamdaman mo, nire-release ka talaga ng person mo. Like, wala siyang magawa. Wala siyang magawa kasi wala siyang kaya compared to the person. Kasi you might be dealing with another person here. And na, nakukuha niya yung energy. Or kung hindi ikaw, pwedeng siya. There's a marriage here. There's a strong relationship here. Na medyo mahirap kalaban. And para sa person mo, I have to release you. Kasi nakikita kanya na masaya ka dyan. Which is hindi naman. Or maaaring hindi niya nakikita sa'yo. Na may pag-asa pa ba kayong dalawa. So this person is releasing you. And we have your separation. So possible there's distance. And not only distance. You deserve love. I don't feel like you are feeling the love that you deserve sa ngayon. Pero you're still continuing this. etong connection mo, itong relationship mo with the present. Pwedeng ikaw kasi yung in relationship dito is kung sino na lang yung may karelasyon dito. Hindi mo nakukuha yung love or yung pagmamahal na deserve mo or para talaga sa'yo. Sabihin na natin, sige, nare-respeto ka ng tao, lahat, ganyan, and maraming natutuwa sa inyo, but hindi yun enough. May mas mahihigit pang pagmamahal na karapat talaga. Karapat dapat talaga para sa'yo. Pero hindi maibigay sa'yo yon because there's your twin flame right there. Sobrang down, sobrang nasasaktan. And there's this separation calling for you to have this separation. I feel like some of you, this is the advice. Lalo na pag hindi na healthy yung relationship. You might be dealing with an older person here or someone who is mature and medyo bossy kind of person. I don't know. I feel like kahit anong gawin niya or sabihin niya, sumusunod ka na lang. And I feel like this is not healthy for you. Hindi healthy eh. We have your king of pentacles, seven of wands. This is your person. Aries, Leo, Sag, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Energy. Looking at you, stalking right here with the camera, reminiscing. Binabalik-balikan niya yung mga naka nakaraan. But with the seven of wands, there's some sort of a blockage. So maaaring a lot of people is like blocking this person. So maaaring hindi lang, hindi lang yung person mo yung nagbablock sa kanya. Pero pwedeng, I don't know, you might have blocked this person as well. Pwedeng isa ka pa sa nakapablock dito. Pero nakakagawa siya ng paraan para makita ka. Tignan ka. Kung binlock mo siya, nakakagawa siya ng paraan. This person really miss you. Loves you. Tsaka ang dami niya natutu natutunan sa'yo ah. 
ano no, p- pwedeng may naituro ka dito sa person na ito na maaaring binabalik-balikan niya yung time na yon. Pwedeng memories, pwedeng scenario na meron siya ng tutunan sa'yo. And we have here the magician, queen of swords, and nine of cups. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Energy. You might be holding a baby. I don't know. I'm seeing someone here holding a baby. And with the Queen of Swords, I feel like uh, you feel complete. Or pwedeng yun nga. You feel complete kasi pwedeng may family involved here. Pero you're not being honest with the magician. Ang dami mo dito mga ginagawang. I mean, you're, you're not being honest. I can see you, you want new beginning. Gusto mo rin ng new beginning between the two of you. The problem is ayaw mong makasakit with the Queen of Swords. Okay. With the with the nine of cups, I feel like you're welcoming this opportunity. Eto mga mga ba ko ano man ang ibigay sa you, like whatever it is na every day of your life, you're welcoming this. Pero sa likod ng mind mo, alam mong hindi ka masaya, hindi ka okay. You're not being real here. You have your heart, heart with a key. Welcoming love. Meeting meeting the one. Open your heart. Getting together. Perfect. Kasi siya yung may hawak sa puso mo eh. Ang hirap ibigay dito sa tao sa paligid mo, yung mga pagmamahal, kahit hindi lang sa person mo, I feel like apektado lahat. From work, from mga family na yan, kahit hindi dito sa person mo, if you're married, hindi sa asawa mo, kahit sa mga tao sa paligid mo, apektado. Kasi yung, yung taong makakapag-open sa kung ano ka talaga, kung saan ka magiging mas masaya, yung may hawak ng puso mo, eh wala. Which is this, your twin flame. Tinatry mong mag-focus sa mga bagay na nasa harap mo ngayon. We have your four of cups. This is your person's energy. Um, there's a lot of doubt. Planning. A lot of planning for the future. Pero na iisip niya kahit anong plano niya, hindi siya magiging masaya kasi wala ka eh. Kung baga wala ka, dun, wala ka dun sa choices, but then ikaw yung gusto niyang piliin. Ikaw yung choice niya. We have your page of one, so a lot of message. So, maaaring may mga nagpa-flirt or na- nagtatry makipag-connect dito sa person mo. Like, a lot of people, you might be dealing with someone na medyo talagang may itsura. Or sabihin na natin, kahit pa paano, eh, maraming umaaligid-aligid. But, no. Hindi ka man kasama sa option, pero ikaw ang choice niya. With a Grim Reaper. Your person is trying to transform his or her life. I'm seeing letter A, number 5, W, letter L. Ayan. No, walang talaga siya na pag-asa. Kaya nga nire-release ka niya eh. Kaya lang, may mga blockage din kasi. You are here the runner. So, maaaring, maaaring kaya nagbablock or may blockage is because ikaw yung umaalis or lumalayo. You're listening to your ego. Pero alam mong masakit para sa'yo na mawala itong taong to. And with the four of pentacles and eight of wands, ang dami mong tinatago dito. And you knew, na kahit anong tago mo, mahirap para itago sa sarili mo, itanggi sa sarili mo kung ano yung totoong nararamdaman mo. With the eight of wands, you're just listening to them or to whatever is happening to you right now. Kung baga, you're just focusing on on your goals, on your plans. Every day of your life, you're focusing dito sa mga na, nasa harapan mo. Pero, yun yun, you're in pain kasi hindi ka kumpleto. I don't feel you being complete. Especially with the Nine of Swords. 
pinapakita sa iyo ng dreams mo pero ay kulang kulang sa action. Kulang sa 3D, lahat na sa 5D. And hindi ka nalil- nakikinig sa mga dreams mo. Alam mo naman kung ano yung totoo sa sarili mo pero hindi mo pinakikinggan. And because of these restrictions, pwede may mga restrictions kasi. Ayun yung nakakapagpahirap. And we have your strength. Two of pentacles. Uh, medyo nag-shift yung energy dito ha. Medyo nag-shift yung energy dito. Time will come, this person would acknowledge itong love na ito, itong presence mo na ito, na kahit anong layo niya, you're still there. So with the two of pentacles, um, maybe hindi pa siya okay sa ngayon, may imbalance pa na nangyayari dito. But I feel like dito sa mga ginagawa niya, this would lead into you eh. Papunta pa rin sa'yo. There's some sort of a travel here. To see you, to have you, to have a relationship with you. Pero currently, stuck in a third-party relationship. And with the three of pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, energy. And we have your clock. So it needs time. Wait ka lang, maghintay ka lang. Time will come. We have your also bottom of the deck, love call. This person is going to call you in the near future na ito ha. In the near future. Ayan no. I like you. Photograph. Hindi mo, kumbaga ito mangyayari ito pag hindi mo na naiisip tong taong to. Doon niya soon marirealize na kahit anong try niyang umalis sa situation yung dalawa. Hindi ka maaalis doon. Kumbaga, it feels like a star yung tingin niya sa'yo. Tingin niya sa'yo you're like a star. Bakit? Kahit umulan, kahit madilim, of course, magpapakita ang star, di ba, pag gabi na. Pero kahit halimbawa umuulan, yung star nakatago lang sa clouds. Yun ang tingin niya sa'yo. Na kahit anong gawing ng panahon, kahit anong pilit ng panahon na burahin, or siya mismo na burahin ka, hindi ka mabubura. Nandun ka pa rin. Matapos lang yung bagyo, yung, de, yung whatever it is, paglipas nun, pag alis ng mga clouds na yan, nandun ka pa rin. And ganun yung emotion niya sa'yo. Na kahit anong mangyari, nandun ka pa rin. Because you're his or her soulmate. Of course, this is a, this is a twin flame reading. Hindi na ako magtataka kung lalabas ang soulmate dito sa bottom of the deck. And you have here two of cups, page of swords. Time will come also that you will fight for this. Ngayon nga lang hindi ka pa ready. Hindi pa kayo parehong ready. Pero time will come you would fight for this connection, for this love. Alam mo mangyayari yun. After this coffin, which is coffin, which is, you know, ending. And ending, endings bring new beginnings. So, kung ano yung matatapos, another new beginning ang lalabas, of course. And this time around, we have your addiction. Kung ano man yung nag-control sa'yo, yung nagbablock, yung nagpipigil sa'yo, yun yung mag end dito. Because addiction, and then followed by the coffin. So, kung ano man yung addiction na ito, yung dependent relationship na ito, connection na ito, obsession, possession na ito. Yung feeling mo pag mamayari ka na ng iba, matatapos lahat ng yon And once na matapos lahat na yon there's this you fighting for this connection, for this relationship, and ganun din naman siya sa'yo. So let's get more cards for you. This is for your advice. What do we have here for Aries? Twin Flame Reading, please. Spirit guys, angel guys. Please help me, give me answers advice for our Aries twin flame reading please thank you for Aries okay oh 
Oh my card for our hours, friends. I feel like I need one more. We have your like, attract likes. Honesty is essential. Relationship patterns. What's with the relationship patterns? Okay, I'll take this. Okay, so we have your like, attract likes. Honesty is essential. For me, this is a twin flame card. This like, attract likes. Kasi it looks like a twin for me. Ayan no. Can you see the young lady here holding another lady that looks like her? Pareho sila ng face. And then as the same. Ayan. Yun. So nagiging, for me, it's a twin flame card for me. Ayan. So, for what I can see here, oh, and then of the card, spiritual connection, another soulmate card for me here, dito. Our relationship has a connection that goes beyond this lifetime. Of course, twin flame reading ito. Spiritual connection. Ibig sabihin, kahit ilang life pa ang dumating sa'yo, you're still spiritually connected. But you need to be honest. Kahit hindi man lang dito sa sarili, eh, kahit hindi man lang dito sa taong to, pero kailangan mong maging totoo sa sarili mo. I-embrace mo yung emotion na nararamdaman mo. Relationship pattern. It takes strength to recognize the need for change. Kailangan mo talaga maging malakas sa ngayon kasi malaking pagbabago ang mangyayari. And uh, kung ano man yung paulit-ulit na nangyayari sa relasyon or sa connection or whatever, matatapos lang ng lahat ng yan if you would listen with your heart. Diba? Kasi maaaring itinatanggi mo sa puso mo, sa isipan mo kung ano yung totoo. Pero ang totoo, we have your spiritual connection. Alam mo kung ano yung connection mo ko sa kanya. Alam mo kung sino siya sa'yo. At alam mo kung ano totoong nararamdaman mo sa kanya. So, bakit mo itatanggi? ba? Diba? So, ayun lamang po. That's it for now, Aries. Thank you for watching. I hope nakaresonate kayo. Please do like and subscribe to our channel, Unicorn Princess Tarot, Madam PTV. I love you all guys again and bye-bye.